What's up, everybody? As you can see, my sunburn is in full effect. Uh, went to the beach today, had a good time, and, you know, got too much sun. Um, but what I'm going to be going over today is how to run a default um, on Mirage T-Side. So, to explain what a default is, if you're an IGL, there's a couple different ways that you can look at the game. Um, one of the most common ones, it's a bit of a looser style, um, is a default. So you usually, for like a Mirage, you'd either have two people go to the site that you're planning hypothetically to hit, um, then two people go to mid and one more person going to the opposite site. Um, you can have a 1-3-1, one, one, so one person at each site and then three go mid, depending on how much mid control you want to get. Um, and depending on if you want to predetermine which site you're going to. Um, off of these defaults, there's you can get map control off of them. You can just sit back and hold for a push and then set up an execute, have everybody come back to like A and throw smokes over um, at like 45 seconds if there's been no contact. Uh, there's just a lot of different ways to go about it, but this is uh, my personal preference. So we're gonna, it's going to be a 1-3-1. One, and um, we're going to have the A player just hang out either, but it's really up to their uh, preference, wherever they're comfortable. Um, this is a good spot here, not all the way in the corner, but here you can see a bit more. Um, so I'm not all the way in the corner. You can see people here. Um, and then in Palace, you could hold an off angle here, um, an off angle up on here. This is always nice. Uh, if they do swing, you're kind of fucked, though. Um, just, like, differently like, off angles, just holding for push, trying to get the info. Um, a B player can hang back here, um, because by the time you're walking up here, you're probably going to be checking there. Maybe a quick, um, clear, but you can get them off guard. You don't want to be pushed, like, I mean, you can be pushed up in the kitchen. It depends on, like, how your, uh, mid-map control is going but you want to hold for an underpass push as well so that's the two people on sites their job is fairly easy just hold for a push and if you do go to that site um, help throw a smoke um, throw something that can I don't know just like try to uh, play off your teammates this is a good smoke to throw if you are an A like defaulter and you're up on here waiting for a push um, and you have people going through connector like right about there. Um, that's gonna smoke off your right side jungle so they can get up through on a site. Um, that's always good. But so, to get to the meat of this. So, um, before you even have any players here, or depending on how fast or slow you want to take the round, it's really up to you as an IGL. Um, or your team in that for that matter you can immediately throw a window smoke right off the bat and have a couple players lined up here uh, waiting for a push flashing over and then while well, having a person like here waiting for the flash and then once the flash pops peeking into it with window smoked um, that's one way to do it, just to get out, um, and once you're out, there's different things that you can do. Um, you can also, if you want to take it a bit slower, and you don't want to waste a, well, like, not waste a window smoke, but, um, I don't know, use a smoke for window at that point, you can always just smoke off the top mid, um, you'll have a bit of an easier time crossing, you don't have to worry about cat or connector, um, throw a flash in there. And then all you have to do is worry about the run-up. Um, you can, well, depending on how slow you go, you may have to worry about somebody peeking cat. Um, if it's an immediate thing, you're probably not going to have to worry about somebody peeking cat. Uh, because if you do have a teammate anywhere here, they will hear the person running up cat too. Um, so that's a ways to get like out mid. You're going to want to have three players mid. Um, they don't. One of them doesn't have to have an op. It would be preferred. Um, the op can go A or B to like hold for picks or something. Um, so that's really like up to you. It could easily be three AKs. It could be two AKs on op. Um, but so different things that you can do from top mid. You can throw a window smoke like that. So I lined up, as you can see, up on this and then across from this. Um, 
so that smokes off the window. A CT smoke. So I'm gonna get in this corner and that's the middle bar here. Um, all the way there, that's gonna smoke off your CT. Um, and then there's a cat smoke that you can throw like that. So let's show you the CT one, that's pretty nice. The cat smoke, that's pretty nice. So there's, you can go to any site from mid. Um, and what you would really want to do on a default here is, so you have a teammate flash out. Let's say um, you went for a window smoke at the start of the round, okay? You have a teammate flash you out, okay? You shoulder it, nobody's there in con. Um, the teammate that flashed you out comes up and molly's con just so you can't get peeked while you're holding down cat um you chair is a bit i don't know risky because if you're stuck in this corner you have to have you have to waste utility to get out of it um you have to check and ladder the person that entered and still had a molly molly off the ladder and then wait for them to come out here or something or wait for to hear the uh, sound cue of the vent break um but really once you get out it depends on how you want to play the round. If you want to go slow or if you want to go for a fast A split. Um, in that case, you would have both of your like sight players going towards A um, and holding. He would throw this. Well, one of your A players would throw this smoke. Um, you would have the top mid CT smoke. Um, and then you would have a cat smoke as well. Let's just throw that. That's not... It's not the best cat smoke, but let's just throw that. You got cat smoke, all that, so you'd be able to come up here, clear stairs, not have to worry about jungle, um, and clear off site. And then you would have two players, maybe one ramp, one palace, maybe both ramp, maybe both palace, um, but helping clear off site and waiting for the connector contact. So that's uh, an easy A split that you can do, an easy uh, B split that you can do if you put two people in the apps. Um, and if you do do, like, if you do do, uh, if you do complete splits, so you don't have anybody towards A or you don't have anybody towards B, you have to do them relatively fast, um, or else a B player or an A player is kind of push through and get all the information that nobody's there, and they'll start rotating people over. Um, so a B split, um, I would suggest having a Molly in Con. There is a way to smoke top Con. It's a little challenging let me see if i remember it uh maybe um let's see if that's it oh we were so close we were so close all right so what i'm doing is i'm lining up with the top of that and this leaf like not uh, yeah i messed up that so it's like there yeah I'm pretty sure Alright, yeah. So you can smoke top con like that. Um, like, there's not too much of a gap, and nobody's going into connector in the first place, so it's cool. If you throw that smoke and then molly off, oops, molly off inside of the connector, um, you should be able to get up cat. Of course, this is all done with a window smoke. Um, so close. Um, but that will allow you to get up. Um, you would want both your apps players not taking the contact. They don't want to be seen at this point. Um, so standing like here or waiting for a push um, up until this guy swings out cat and makes contact. Um, as soon as he shoots the van player or bench or whatever he's playing in the site anchor is going to be looking towards there. And that's when you all start to uh, flash out and run out and really make it hard on the CTs to defend. So you, you just have to time your pushes together. Um, and there's a lot of creativity you can do once you get mid control. That's why I elect to do a 1-3-1 default um, compared to like a 2-2-1 two, two, or a 1-2-2. Two, two. So I hope this has helped uh, increase your strategicness. I don't know. Thank you for watching.